I can hear the music now. There's my stupid voice. Right. Well, um, yeah, hello and welcome back to Joyless Gaming and, um, happy Halloween, I guess. It's, uh, approaching midnight for me, but... Uh, there's only a few parts of the world that are actually further ahead than I am, so... It'll probably still be Halloween by the time other people see this. And, um, yeah. Freddy Fazbear's Pizzeria Simulator. I've not played the other FNAF games because, uh... I didn't want to. Frankly, I don't really want to play this either, but it's free! And I actually have technically played this before, even though you wouldn't know it. Despite, you know, because of the fact that I've got this loading up. But, uh, apparently it keeps local saves, so, new computer. Mm. Not that it really matters. No, fuck off, stupid sticky keys. <laughs> Shadow Bear. Ah, oh, sticky keys. <laughs> Why do I bother? Dead space, three, two, one. The purpose of this tape is to test automated response times and reactions from vintage interactive attractions following audio stimuli. If you are playing this tape, that means that not only have you been checking outside at the end of every shift, as you were instructed to do, but also that you have found something that meets the criteria of your special obligations under paragraph four. Follow these instructions, document response times, then safely secure the space before leaving. Upon sealing the room, you are not to return. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. Document results. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. Document results. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. Not at all creepy. Document results. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one.
<laughs> it's a new day. It's your time to shine. It's time to take your career into your own hands. You've saved money your whole life. Great. Now it's time to put all your eggs into one basket and take a huge gamble on your future. <laughs> a gamble that comes with a 100% chance of success in some cases. What are we talking about? We're talking about becoming a Fazbear Entertainment franchisee. That's right, restaurant ownership and management. Something almost anyone can do with a limited degree of success. Sure, it's a lot of money to invest, but everyone's doing it. And that means it's safe and lucrative. With your initial investment, you'll receive everything you need to get started, including a small room, some tables, and electricity. But don't forget about the money you had left over after buying your franchise package. Use it to decorate, buy a stage, buy attractions and animatronics, and much, much more. Now, let's take a look at a few things that will help you get started as a Fazbear Entertainment franchisee, such as atmosphere. Making sure your establishment has an inviting atmosphere is essential to bringing in new customers. Entertainment. Having a lot of entertainment value in your restaurant will ensure that customers come back. Bonus revenue. Coin-operated games and attractions can generate <laughs> additional money revenue during nerds. the day, which oh, means yeah. more money in your pocket, ready for reinvestment. Health and safety. There may be times when you purchase something of questionable quality, and we don't blame you. Cutting corners is just good business. But there are steps you can take to ensure you don't get sued for it. And that brings us to liability. Being a thrifty shopper is smart, but be aware that buying things on sale comes with a certain amount of risk. Aside from the daily risk of lawsuits, there's also the risk that something might be hiding inside whatever you just purchased with that steeply discounted price tag. Of course, that would only be a serious danger if there were something outside that's been trying <laughs> to get in for months now, which we are not confirming to be the case. <laughs> This concludes the amount of help we are legally obligated to provide. Remember, you are now the face of the newly rebranded Freddy Fazbear's Pizza. Wear that smile with pride and let's make some money. Fazbear Entertainment is not responsible for disappearance, death, or dismemberment. How motivating. Yes. Well, as I said, I, I have actually technically played this before, but I have not actually finished it properly, as in where you do all the salvaging and get the real proper ending. So I'm going to try and do that. But I don't like games like this. I don't like jump scares and jack-in-the-boxes. It's not that they don't get me. It's just that I don't like them. I can be startled just like anyone else, but it's not fun. I don't think it's properly scary. It's just surprising. And I know normally people do this sort of um, thing with uh, a face cam, but I don't want to do that. I don't want to put my face on the internet. Let's see how much cash you had left over after purchasing your franchise package. Great, that should be more than enough. Now let's get started. On your left are your product catalogs. You can unlock more expensive catalogs by simply purchasing items for your pizzeria. Use the arrows in the bottom right of the item window to browse the products for each catalog. When you're finished shopping, click the button labeled Blueprint Mode to place your items. You can switch back and forth between Catalog Mode and Blueprint Mode as often as you like before opening your doors to the public. When you're ready to open your restaurant for business for the day, click the button labeled Finished in Blueprint Mode. Give it a try and do some shopping. Right, well, I'm gonna need some stuff. bat to to get some extra money I in sponsorship offers <laughs> oh, 
I'm a winner. I want to be able to get the larger floor plan, but I want to get other stuff as well. giving me enough. Because I want to be able to get the sanitation station. Ooh, 3D Maze Arcade. Um... got a better score. And yes, I know there's a thing. I know there's a thing to uh, to do there. I do like the music for this um I might want to turn the volume down. No, I don't want to exit the game. Alright, well, okay. We want to... Let's see what else we can get. Revenue generator. Oh yeah, the gumball. I could buy the sturdy stage and then buy one of the cheap animatronics. <laughs> Maximize my revenue going into some of these nights. So, yeah, okay, I'm gonna have to see about... Just pardon me a second. 
while I look for, yeah, I have to adjust this later. Hopefully that's coming through a bit less on the mix. Hopefully it's not too quiet though. I should be checking that. I should absolutely be checking that. Just a second. Yeah, that sounds like a better mix, not coming through too loud. Oh, if I had two screens, oh, that'd be easy to do that. Do I want to put a coin slot on something so cheap? Probably not. Let's just make some more revenue out of this, hopefully. Secret. <laughs> yeah, so try not to run anybody over. Seems like I'm going a bit too fast. Ought to be a, some sort of speed limit or something. Right, I want to buy... I think I want to buy the thing, although do I want to get more entertainment type stuff rather than the fruity maze? I want to run the fruity maze as well, I suppose, but it's not my goal. My goal is to actually just try and get the proper ending. Oh, Candy Cadet. Make that money. Um. I am the candy cadet. Come get your candy here. I have candy all day, every day. Candy, candy, candy. 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 Return to candy cadet again, and maybe <laughs> I will tell you a story. Yeah, that's the name of the little, like, pink and white bear, isn't it, Helpy? The... This little dude, there he is. Look at him dance. <laughs> Alright, so we can put a coin slot on that. Yeah. I am the candy cadet. Come get your candy here. I have candy all day, every day. Candy. 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 Return to Candy Cadet again, and maybe I will tell you a story. I feel like I'm gonna have to do something for entertainment. How many more? Two tokens. Two tokens left. Um... Let's just get I am some a candy, candy. Cadet. Come get your candy here. I have candy all day, every day. Candy, candy, candy. Damn Return it. to Candy Cadet again. And maybe scoring. I will tell you a story. Candy Cadet, come get your candy here. I have candy all day, every day. 
Candy. Because I've, candy. I've heard that he is candy. actually supposed to have some stories. I mean, Return that, to Candy but... Cadet again, and maybe I will tell you a story. Probably have to do other things to get him to do it. Okay. Right, 400. What can I do with 400? Happy Frog. <laughs> Lights. Let's get some. Uh, yeah, why not? All right, well, let's call that a day. First night, so I don't have to worry about anything. Your restaurant is now officially open. Awesome. That doesn't mean your job is finished, however. You have a lot of work to do while page Maybe I shouldn't have muted him. But I know what he says. So Zed's power, X is the fan. Can't do that with the keys? Oh, I can't do that with the keys. That's gonna get annoying, I think. That interrupts the tasks anyway, doesn't it? Yeah. It's annoying how that happens. Okay, so do I still keep monitoring the temperature with the power off? But the temperature doesn't go off go up with the power off, does it? Gotta get used to how it works. If I'm going to survive when there are actually things coming to get me. The temperature's still going up. I won't get killed on the first night. He will just be standing there whereas I get killed other times. What does it cost for the... Okay, the... I don't even know what the higher handyman is supposed to do. I know what the printer does. It makes it faster and quieter. Same with the... Uplink. Guess maybe the handyman makes the... Uh, things go faster? Shame he can't do it automatically. The uh, yeah, the printer was five. I was five hundred for the two other things. So 
Great job. It looks like you're getting the hang of this. Now let's just focus on getting you through your first week. There's a big party here Saturday, and you should view that day as your ultimate test. Make it through Saturday, and you will have proven yourself as the successful entrepreneur that we all know you can be. Yeah. You say that. Congratulations on completing your first. first day. However, your job isn't over just yet. There is another aspect to your end of day routine, and that is inspecting and salvaging any animatronics found in the alley outside the back door. Things are found here quite often, and while we aren't sure why, what we do know is that they can be used for parts, which can mean a much needed revenue boost before starting your next day. Of course, as with everything else in this line of work, those benefits come with risk. The safest thing to do is to throw it back outside, but then you get no money for the salvage. Choose to keep it, and you run the risk of certain negative consequences, namely death, should the item in question not be as docile as it first appeared. If you do decide to try to salvage it, then you must complete the maintenance checklist. During this testing phase, check on the animatronic frequently. If you feel that it is becoming unstable, use the taser provided to you. You can use it three times without damaging the hardware. Every use over three, however, will decrease the item's salvage value. Before you is an animatronic found in the back alley. We are unsure of its origins. It is your job to complete the maintenance checklist before claiming it as salvage, or if you choose to, you can throw it back into the alley where you found it and forfeit payment. Please make your choice now. Oh, you have chosen to proceed with the maintenance checklist. Remember, use your company-issued taser to return the animatronic to a neutral state if you feel yeah. that it's becoming unstable or aggressive. You can only like use it three times before it begins to damage the animatronic and decrease its value. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. Document results. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. Document results. I will document results. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. Document results. I really don't like the look of that. Hmm. <laughs> wonder if it makes it worse if I damage the hardware. Begin audio prompt in three, I know it reduces the salvage two, value, but I don't know one. if it makes it worse later on. Document results. Begin audio... Back the fuck off, mate. You'll prompt in three, two, one. Document results. You have completed the maintenance checklist well, okay. and may proceed with the salvage. Well What's done. What's this game about, Fluffy? In it's about jump scares. That's what it's about. Thanks for letting me join the party. I'll try not to disappoint.
Okay, um... Ooh! Mm. Very good for revenue, you have to put the safety straps on it though. Ooh! Cost a thousand bucks. Mark down! I mean, it's good, but I don't want to... I hate when they... <laughs> you might get something you don't want. Alright, so... I need to generate revenue, so... I need to get money. Actually, this has got a mini-game on it, isn't it? Let's see if I can get this mini game completed. Are you having fun there, Max Stand? <laughs> oh, sponsorship offer. I forgot about this. Give me that jukebox. Never heard of this game. It's part of the Five Nights at Freddy's franchise. Uh, I'll put the safety straps on later. One coming for the PS5, huh? Damn it! I have done this before. It is doable. even worse. It's a big scoring game that one when you can do well. sucking at this. Uh, okay, I've got some money again. What else can we get? Oh no, wait, it's 550 for the um, hoops. Well, I've got to use these play tokens anyway, so keep going.
Oh, crap. Uh. Right, I can get Okay, okay, I can get the hoops. <laughs> Pizza is not your friend. King. That's that's the one you really want. The pickles. That's the one you really really want. Jar of pickles. Oh, the things you buy are about attracting customers and increasing revenue and surviving the week so that you can, uh, you know, keep going. To prevent you from going bankrupt, it's sort of a secondary mechanic that if you go bankrupt, you can't really keep playing. And that Faz rating, if you get above a certain Faz rating is how you get those pickles, I think, but... you don't do very well. I was doing better with this. El Chip. I have no idea how to get El Chip. tokens. Bloody hell. Um, right, let's give this one more go. Back to dying to this pizza. Space pizza. Music's better too. Fucker. I'm trying to zip through the middle of them and I just went up and died. I'm wasting a lot of time on these mini games.
Yay! Finally, I look somewhat competent. Alright, I got one... One left. What have we got? Ah, oh, there's L-Chip. I don't think I'll be able to get L-Chip. Because I want to survive. So I want to be able to buy... I mean, I, a thousand to be able to upgrade the floor plan would be nice, but I want to be able to buy the... Uh, the thingy upgrades. To make my <laughs> nightly job easier. Should buy the floor plan upgrade, but I want to buy the uh, the things tonight. So let's see if I can survive. I'll turn that off. Hey, King Horse. <laughs> Thanks for the host. I'm trying to avoid dying. I am, yes. It's after midnight. Was that bef in behind me or in front of me? It's after midnight, so it's not even Halloween for me anymore.
Oh, and thanks for the follow, Max Stand. Um, getting paranoid. Actually, if I'm doing loud printing, I may as well have the vent going. Um, yeah, uh, as for a follow, I usually tell people I, um, don't always stream the same things or at the same times, and, uh, I don't try to persuade or cajole people into hanging around if they don't like what they see, so if you ever see me doing anything you don't want to watch or whatever, or you can't because of times and that, feel free to not. I'm fine with that. It's fine if you you don't have to waste your time on me. And that's the night. Cool. I survived my first night. Now I have to survive, what, four more? Before you is an animatronic found in the back alley. We are unsure of its origins. It is your job to complete the maintenance checklist before claiming it. You have chosen to proceed with the maintenance checklist. Remember, use your company as your taser to return the animatronic to a neutral state if you feel that it's becoming unstable or aggressive. You can only use it three times before it begins to damage the animatronic and decrease its value. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. One. Document results. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. Document results. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. Surrounded by robots that want to kill me. Document results. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. Document results. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. Don't you fucking dare, okay?
document results. I always come back. You fucking cheated. Cheated me out of a thousand bucks. Customs were turned away. I need to buy the bigger floor plan. for more stuff we got okay uh, the stages are here aren't they why is that unavailable anything still here oh it's in very good condition this time These things could help me, but no. Can you do anything with them aside from... No, you can't. So if they've got risk, they've got risk. afford it. Right. Okay. Uh, I could buy the bigger stage and still buy the medium animatronics, couldn't I? Because this only sells a stage for two. Punch for everyone. <laughs> Lemonade for everyone. <laughs> um. Oh, there's yeah, there's one behind the. Thing there, so I could get the uh, what else could I get? Yeah, Free Maze Arcade. Let's buy Mr. Hippo and we'll buy the medium stage.
This is probably gonna be bad, but over here. Where was the magnet? There it is. everything. Can I get over around there? I can. That's not everything? Damn. Stop telling me to get L-chip. I can't afford L-chip. <laughs> hey, I actually got everything. shouldn't have done that. I was going to do the free maze again. I just remembered that this one's over here.
Can I not go out the... No? You said, can't ignore me, I have to go and bang on the door again? Yeah, the music's pretty good. Especially on the, yeah, the midnight something or other. I don't know. Whatever it was called. we do what I intended to do, which is to see if I can do better at this. I did it. What the? I'm pretty sure she, that little girl who's playing it, had a pet or something that died, and now is the one that is the real what the.
Yeah. Okay, what else have we got to... Yeah, <laughs> Blood and Guts Pac-Man, yeah. I can't afford any of that. I've basically bought most of the revenue generators. I think I should just try and get some extra money and, and like polish these up. Lemonade for Everone. Punch for everyone. It's only one. Oh, I polished that, okay. Alright. Well, I may as well use my play tokens, but hey, how about we go for the. I am a candy cadet. Come get your candy here. I have candy all day, every day. Candy, candy, candy. Return to candy cadet again, and maybe I will tell you a story. Maybe he will, but I don't think he will. I am a candy cadet. Come get your candy here. I have candy all day, every day. Candy, candy, candy. Return to Candy Cadet again, and maybe I will tell you a story. There's something to do with the colors at the right time that you can get more points guaranteed, but... I think, I don't know. Okay. Night two.
think I might be dead. I just died. Passed out, yeah. Died from passing out because the temperature is high because I was trying to be able to hear the fucking things. Ah, oh, bloody hell. Now... Oh, yeah. My first death. Does it, um... Oh, pardon me. Yeah, it saves it before you... Yeah. Does it mean that it keeps my purchase of the... Or hiring of the handyman? Yeah. As long as I don't have to go through all of the uh, mini game things again. I'm gonna get got. Why'd I do that?
Don't know what constitutes like the starting noise and the leaving noise. This is not conducive to a calm work environment. Fucking hell. Yeah, now we have to add another one. Before you is an animatronic found in the back alley. We are unsure of its origins. It is your job to complete the maintenance checklist before claiming it as salvage. You have chosen to proceed with the maintenance checklist. Remember, use your company-issued taser to return the animatronic to a neutral state if you feel that it's becoming unstable or aggressive. You can only use it three times before it begins to damage the animatronic and decrease its value. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. Document results. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. Document results. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. Where the fuck do these sounds come from? Document results. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. 
feel like I'm gonna get eaten by this thing. Document results. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. Document results. You have completed the maintenance checklist and may proceed with the salvage. Well done. End tape. Okay. Got you two don't grand really that time. know who your employer is, do you? No one turned away. Money. Money, 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 money. Okay, thanks for stopping by. I hope it wasn't too dull for you, Max Stand. Have a good uh, day? Night? I don't know. It's one o'clock in the morning for me, so have a good whatever the rest of the, your day will be. I want this. Actually, I want that too. Safety is really just to mitigate liability risks. Mainly interested in revenue. So it'd be the balloon card, I guess. as a revenue generator. Oh, sponsorship. I forgot about those. <laughs> I think I can get the... Um The sound system's in here, isn't it? Yeah. Okay, what's the big stage going for? Patch. Mm, 
Yeah, you kind of need... Yeah. Let's get Freddy and let's get the, uh... stations. Just gonna do the balloons. It's faster than playing the mini games. I'm guessing it's random, but I don't know. It's hard to tell. Seems like the faster you do it, the less points you get, but... But this is definitely a lot faster than playing the minigames and getting decent points for it, so... Well, if I can save that, I've actually bought all of my upgrades for the overnight work. So... I've even shined and polished everything. Cool.
Damn it. Saves when you press finished. Was eating uh, fun size Snickers. Yeah, ice cream stickers are nice. Played this game before and got the uh, like the non-canon endings or some of them. It's a hell of a lot easier when you don't have to worry about these fucking animatronics. There was a whole bunch of uh, knockoff uh, Five Nights at Freddy's games after it uh, after the first one became a big hit. Hear you there, fuck off.
Come on, go away. Passed out. Yeah, that secondary vent is not good enough. Well, at least that was faster. They were all up the top and I made a noise there and, and it didn't distract them at all. You try to prevent making noise and you just die of heat overload. Gonna die. Okay, yeah. This is why I don't like these games. I mean, the jump scares are, you know, annoying enough, but the tedium of having to deal with this sort of mechanic is. Where am I? Where are you?
You may not recognize me at first, but I assure you, that's still me. Gonna die. It's fitting that I got all of the loud work done first, and then you fucked me over. Yeah. What's annoying is that it has nothing really whatsoever to do with my patience, because... I'm dying because I can't keep the ventilation going. to see. I suppose it helps that it doesn't matter that I don't have a face cam because you just see me jerking around. You don't hear me making lots of stupid noises and flailing and shit. Just like sudden... Ugh. 
It's annoying. I'm getting the loud work done first, and then I'm getting fucked over. Save the loud work until last, I guess. Gonna die.
Fucking hell. <sighs> yeah, gameplay in this is kind of tedious. Before you is an animatronic found in the back alley. We are unsure of its origins. It is your job to complete the maintenance checklist before claiming it as... You have chosen to proceed with the maintenance checklist. Remember, use your company-issued taser to return the animatronic to a neutral state if you feel that it's becoming unstable or aggressive. Is it in a neutral state? You can state? only use it three times before it begins to damage the animatronic and decrease its value. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. Document results. That looks too aggressive to me. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. If I reduce the salvage value but manage to still get money out of it, then that's something. Document results. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. Fuck you so much. Cheating me out of five grand, you piece of shit. Oh well. Would have been a much better number with, you know, another 5,000 on that. Would have been able to get the puppet and would have actually got two certificate things. No, I could get the puppet, I suppose. Yeah. Uh, but I also wanted to get the... the other thing. This thing, I wanted that. Stopping kids from from leaving the place unattended. Third one is the uh, the final one. No, okay. Hmm. 
<laughs> Those kids are inside each other. I guess it must be the fourth one. Because I know how this ends. I've seen it. Must be the fourth one. Yeah. And somebody went and stuck something on top of the box so the puppet couldn't stop the kid with the green from being chopped down. Let's see if Candy D Cadet has got a story for I me. I am a Candy Cadet. Come get your candy here. I have candy all day, every day. Candy, candy, candy. Return to Candy Cadet again, and maybe I will tell you a story. Hmm. Let me see if I can get a high point prize from him and. Maybe I am a candy cadet. <laughs> Come get your candy here. I have candy all day, every day. Candy, candy, candy. Return to candy cadet again, and maybe I will tell you a story. Alright, why bother? Just gonna go get balloons. I get lots of free points for balloons. Not going to be able to... Not really going to be able to do anything, that's the problem. I won't be able to afford the Prize King thing, and even if I could... I wouldn't have tokens left to do anything with it. I buy Lefty when he was the salvage from last night. Lefty's already running around the place. I don't know what it is you're supposed to do to get the uh, pickles. That was 3900? There was something that was 3900, wasn't there? Yes. Again, not much point. Entertainment value at this place. Cool. <laughs> wow. 
well. I don't think there's really anything I can get for a... under a thousand. They would actually help me, you know? I somehow managed to have so much entertainment value, but not a lot of revenue. Interesting. Alright, well, <clears throat> final night. Well, it's not the final, final night, but I don't want to bother doing any bonus nights. I don't think I would survive. as well as the other thingies. Hello, Angel Sand? Angel Sand? Yeah. Good, uh, well, morning. It's nearly two o'clock in the morning. This feels like shit. Fascinating what they have become. Easier than I thought it would be. Bloody hell.
I'm fuck off. That one was even less startling because the bloody ad <laughs> took the surprise away. Uh. So tedious. I mean, I'm used to tedium, but... off. If I weren't so often in danger of passing out...
<laughs> thanks for <laughs> thanks for the follow, Angel Sand. Uh, so I usually tell new followers that um, I don't always play the same things or at the same time. So, uh, and I never try to pressure anyone to hang around. So if you ever don't like what you see or you don't want to watch, um, it's fine. As I tell everyone, yeah, there's only so many hours in the day, you don't have to waste them on me. And this is getting really annoying. You overheat or you get eaten by robots, it's all just... Uh. Mm. How many streams of it? Oh, I've, I've not streamed much lately. Uh, it's usually like a few times a week if I feel like I've got something worth doing. Um, uh, I've been doing it for a few years now though. But I'm not trying to be famous or make a living out of or anything like that. I just do it because I've got I've got time on my hands. I just kind of pushed myself to do this tonight because I've not done much in the last couple of weeks. really haven't felt like doing anything.
Damn it, I'm heating up again. I think that's the last night I need to play. I'm sure there's a secret night, but... Saturday. Oh, do I have to get through Saturday? If I have to get through Saturday night as well, I'm gonna die. This is really... Really bothersome to play. <laughs> okay. Um, right. Can I make enough money to buy the prize king dude? The quickest way to make money is these balloons. Well, sort of. the best way, but still definitely quick. <laughs> if I felt confident that I could get the basketball thing done, I'd probably do that, but I don't feel confident that I could get it done. Candy Cadet. Come get your candy here. I have candy all day, every day. Candy, candy, candy. Return to Candy Cadet again, and maybe I will tell you a story. Well, he says that, but he never does it. air horn, basically. Yeah, not gonna make it. Not gonna get enough money to buy the prize king. Well, what 
what can I get for what I've got? Almost enough to get it. so much entertainment value already. I think I should get the floor <laughs> marked down. <laughs> I guess there's one more night. Shit. I don't know what it is, but I always seem to end up doing better if I do all the quiet stuff first. I don't know if you've just been lucky or not, but yeah, it seems to be the, the way it goes. I end up doing better when I do the quiet things first. Is that on the other side as well?
Ah, oh, shit. Bitch. It feels like my birthday. No, fuck Did you. Did you have a gift for me? Fuck. Don't you love this clown face? Not entirely certain if the uh, vent is actually about making noise or if it's just about making it harder for you to hear if they're making noise.
should have known I'd find you. This sucks.
Hell. Fucking hell. Finally. You played right into our hands. Did you really think that this job just fell out of the sky for you? No. This was a gift for us. You gathered them all together in one place. Just like he asked you to. All of those little souls in one place. Just for us. A gift. Now we can do what we were created to do. And be complete. I will make you proud, Daddy. Watch. Listen. And be full. Connection terminated. I'm sorry to interrupt you, Elizabeth if you still even remember that name. But I'm afraid you've been misinformed. You are not here to receive a gift, nor have you been called here by the individual you assume, although you have indeed been called. You have all been called here, into a labyrinth of sounds and smells, misdirection and misfortune. A labyrinth with no exit, a maze with no prize. You don't even realize that you are trapped. Your lust for blood has driven you in endless circles, chasing the cries of children in some unseen chamber, always seeming so near, yet somehow out of reach. But you will never find them. None of you will. This is where your story ends. And to you, my brave volunteer, who somehow found this job listing not intended for you. Although there was a way out planned for you, I have a feeling that's not what you want. I have a feeling that you are right where you want to be. I am remaining as well. I am nearby. This place will not be remembered, and the memory of everything that started this can finally begin to fade away, as the agony of every tragedy should. And to you monsters trapped in the corridors, be still, and give up your spirits. They don't belong to you. For most of you, I believe there is peace, and perhaps more. 
waiting for you after the smoke clears. Although for one of you, the darkest pit of hell has opened to swallow you whole. So don't keep the devil waiting, old friend. My daughter, if you can hear me, I knew you would return as well. It's in your nature to protect the innocent. I'm sorry that on that day, the day you were shut out and left to die, no one was there to lift you up into their arms the way you lifted others into yours. And then, what became of you? I should have known you wouldn't be content to disappear. Not my daughter. I couldn't save you then. So let me save you now. It's time to rest for you and for those you have carried in your arms. This ends, for all of us, in communication. Congratulations on completing your work week. Ugh. We apologize if your situation wasn't presented to you in a completely honest fashion when you first started, but it was important that your intentions and actions be genuine. Here at Fazbear Entertainment, we value fun, family, and food. But more importantly, we value our commitment to atoning for past mistakes and tying up loose ends. Thank you for your participation. There is no need for you to return to work next week as Fazbear Entertainment is no longer a corporate entity. Please accept this certificate of completion. Goodbye for now, and thank you for taking this journey with us. Yay, I finished a FNAF game. Not that I really want to, but eh, it's something to do, isn't it? And I've watched, you know, videos of other people playing the other things, the other ones in the series. I've seen some of the stuff to do with the story, not all of it. I don't really care. It's it's <laughs> weird that all of the sort of twisted shit in the uh, backstory and lore, as it were, is uh, probably more interesting and compelling than the game itself. Which is just a, yeah, it's just a jack-in-the-box. It's just about surprising people. And, uh, yeah, I don't know. I see people who complain about things like walking simulators as being sort of devoid of gameplay. Well, I mean, there's not a much in the way of gameplay in this either. It's just get lucky. And, uh... Not really a lot of fun, but hey, some people like it. Seems like a game series almost entirely intended for um, for content creators, you know, to overreact to and, you know, scream and flail about and put their stupid faces all over it. We've got Lawkeeper in completion. Uh, there's, there's one for getting through without doing any of the, um, things, and there's one for getting through going bankrupt, and there's one for... That just loads up the final night again, doesn't it? Yeah, just loads up the final night again. Well, oops. <laughs> that quits the entire game. Not back to main menu or anything. Uh, so I best, uh, I guess I better just call it a night there and say thanks everybody for watching. If it was, and those who might watch this in the future, I'm going to go stick this on YouTube. Yeah, I didn't have my face on it, so there was no, you know, watching me twitch as the jump scares got me. But you were not going to get big reactions out of me anyway. And, uh, as always, I'll, um, see everybody next time, whenever, for whatever. Bye for now.